Hey, what's going on YouTube? The Bearded Baron here, and in today's video, we take a look at this week's challenge, Primitive. We're afraid of all electronic equipment, so basically, this is a no electronics run for us, and we're doing this on Ridgeview Court. So if you've liked this video, if you find it informative, if you find it entertaining, any kind of thing like that, be sure to like it, follow, and uh, without further ado, let's get into the video. Oh my gosh! You've got to be kidding me! Sheesh! We got, we we don't have a lot of stuff at all. All right, let's just let's uh let's rip it. I'm officially hating this challenge. I can't do it. Now, does the no electronics count for the power? Can I turn on the power, or am I just going to be screwed? Let's see if we can find it first. Breaker's broken. Oh, no. Well, this is definitely going to be a guess it game. I can't see anything. Do we know what difficulty it's at? I have no idea. Why no pills? Uh, I think it gives us pills. Yep, it is busted. <sighs> okay, that's fine. What's up, tree man? How are you doing? Welcome back. At least I got those lit. All right, we got a Ouija board. No! Oh, it's upstairs. I heard it. All right, I'm going to do it like this. So that way, if it is a raid, then we'll be able to tell. <clears throat> Where are you? How many pineapples can you shove up your butt? Is it zero? Is it? Am I pretty? Am I pretty? Do you think I'm beautiful? Do you like peeps? Do you like clapping cheeks? Yeah, I think it does. play this weekly challenge it's so hard no it's fine it's fine it's fine hmm hmm okay so it's not something it's gonna be rough it's gonna be rough it's gonna be made all right that right there that looks like an emf5 so I can go with, we can go with kind of with an EMF five on that one, right? Um, I'm gonna check to see if we've got salt at all. Drop down all these as well. Could also be. I mean, like they do give you the evidence that you need. You know what I mean? What's up, the corruptor? Allie, thank you for the cat paws. Rare. For the roses and for the ice cream cone, I appreciate it. Hmm. Hmm. Yo, sounded kind of fast. Could have. Maybe he's asking. Was that a twin curve? I wouldn't put a lot of stock into what we formerly knew about this game. I think it's in this room. It's either in that room or it's in the other one over here. Uh, uh. 
What's up, one the gal? How are you doing? What's what's up, ancient? Dang, I miss him. What? Is he? Uh, this game ever scared you? Oh, for sure. Oh, absolutely for sure. See, we got another EMF five. See that zero to five. So that's how we can tell EMF five. Charlie Boo, thank you for the five months. I appreciate it. Um. Psh, 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 psh. I'm probably going to regret this, but we'll take a crucifix. Maybe I can get it up in there before it's able to hunt. Fairy devil? Sure. Why not? Morrow Morrow in dress? Thank you for that follow -up. Get out. Woo. All right, see the tier one thermometer here. All right, we got ghost running. Spirit shade or a miling. See, is that freezing? Nope, that's 33 degrees. Chad, that's 33 degrees. That's not 32 degrees. That's 33. Wow, he shut the door and we didn't hear it again. There's some audio busted on this. Surprise, thank you for the four months. I don't think it's a shade. I think it's a spirit. I think it's EMF five spirit box and ghost writing. Yeah, I'm gonna go spirit. I'm gonna go spirit. Based off of what we've got, just make sure, right? Touch these doors. Not seeing anything. Suppose the thermometer doesn't need power. What's the point of the thermometer? Doesn't the power need it to be on for it to work? No, it does not. It just takes longer. Nerk Mo. Yeah, I'm gonna say spirit. If it's another miling and I get it wrong because of the sound again, I'm gonna be a little bit irritated, but I think overall I think there's a pretty good Yes, forward. And it was a spirit. All right, perfect. So there's one. Let's try it. Let's try it again. So it's not actually, it's not as bad as what I was anticipating, right? You actually do get quite a few stuff to where you can figure it out. I'm actually going to change up my strat this time around, right? Um, so I'm going to go with this, this, and we'll go with this. Hi. I got you. Here we go. Here we go again on my own. Da -da -da -da. Going down the only road I've ever known. Da -da -da -da. I'm a good girl. Born to walk alone. Da -da 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 -da. What? Thank you for that song. Because I made up my mind. I heard it. I heard it. I done heard it someplace. I am wasting no more time. And here we go again. Oh, there's the bone. Oh, it blew out the candle. It blew out the candle. There it is. There it is. We found it. We found it. There it is. Mm-hmm. There it is. There it is. All right. We got it. There we go. Yum. I'll be back. No worries, Haley. I'll be here. I'll be the taller gentleman. How did I know? I'll show you. One, it blew out this candle up front. Right? So that was the first indicator. The second indicator was because the cutting board was on the floor. Normally, it's up over here. And third, it blew out the candle again. Look at that. Would you look, would you look at that? 
right, we're gonna throw this down. Or is it the wind because the door is open? No. It can't, it's paranormal. You doing a 48 hour stream? I'm doing more than 48 hours. Smiles. More than 48 hours. We've been live for six days. And I still got 37 hours to go. Okay. Six days. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Baron is here forever. 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 Put this right there. You know, the Tier 2 and Tier 3 crucifixes also don't require power, game. You know that? I'm just saying. They don't require it. You sleep on stream? I mean, I sleep and the stream keeps going, yes. I don't sleep while you guys can watch me. That's weird. I know. I tried. I tried to get it. I'm going to say no EMF 5. I'm going to say no EMF 5 at all. Alright. I don't want to, but I kind of want to. You sound like you're from Scooby-Doo when the voices switch his bodies? What? I do not poop in a bucket off camera, okay? My poop habits are none of chat's concern. Ah. All right, so we got ultraviolet. Oh, show. Right? So, that's good. I could get into Hunt, maybe. It sucks because there's so much... Like, Gorio, you're never going to be able to tell. So, you're like, you're really hoping that it's not a Gorio. I can't tell if it's a Mimic or not. Uh, we'll be able to tell maybe if it's a Banshee, but, like, to be able to tell that mid-Hunt, that's going to be really hard to do, especially with the candles on. Oh, we got Ghost Riding. So, Poltergeist, Demon, or a Myling. Okay, well, that does make it easier. Cursed Objects is a Ouija board. I'm going to bring in the candelabras just so that way I can see what all the stuff is around the table. Because I'm going to force it to hunt, and then we're going to let it, we're going to run it around the table here. And see if, uh, see if we can't get it to show itself whether or not, I don't think it's a demon at this point in time. It doesn't seem aggressive at all. But you never know with these kind of things. So. Don't write in all caps. My more normal handwriting is kind of awkward. Cursive scrawl. Fair. Kaka, Thank you for that follow. Kaka. Alright. We're going to light as many candles as I can. Hide and seek. Honestly, I'm thinking Miling. I'm thinking Miling. <laughs> Please perish. Oh. No, I don't think it's a Pulte. I don't think. I don't think it's a Pulte. Do it. Do what? Wasn't it didn't throw enough stuff for it to be a pulty, not in my opinion. And I like I said, I don't think it's been aggressive enough, so I think it's a myling. I feel like the footsteps cut off there kind of abruptly at the end. I could have been wrong. Welcome back. Like for bad some jobs for 
Right? That's a problem. That's a problem when you have stuff that's kind of jank for as far as the sounding is concerned. But, oh well. What's up, Brandy? How are you doing? Your question is a pulty? Then it's not a pulty? I mean, it's true, but I always question if it's a pulty. I've seen ghosts throw some stuff, like, across the... A, like, across the house. Right? Like, I've seen ghosts double-touch objects in the air. And they'd be like, no, he's a mare. Like, really? Like, I thought that the poltergeist was the touchy ghost. All right, so let's do this, right? We're going to try to cheat the system here first. Hide and seek. Lotus, thank you for that follow. Or thank you for the for the sub. Hello? Normal speed from the kitchen. Lotus with the sub. Whoop, whoop. Thank you, Lotus. Chad, if we hit the sub goal for the TikTok side, you guys get to pick the next map. DK Poc PC, thank you for the follow. Not a whole lot. Make these seem so easy, then I try them and I just suffer until I die. <laughs> you have to guess consecutive. No, you just have to get three right. That's all we're going for. I love how I used that and we got it to hunt. I'm still at like 98% sanity. So we're pretty solid for a minute here. I'm going to check and see if it touched any doors. Maybe we can get a, a cheeky fingerprints off of it. Now, could you imagine if you had to guess it consecutively? People would be getting pissed. I would be getting pissed. Okay, we got fingies. Here's the thing, too. You don't have to worry about capturing all this, like, additional evidence and stuff like that when you're doing these. Just get your three pieces of evidence and get out. Don't do the secondary objectives. It's not worth it. You're just going for the weekly bonus and everything. That's it. Right? So I wouldn't even waste your time with it. And you don't even have to live, right? Remember that as well. Like, dying or stuff like that? Doesn't matter. I mean, you could just run in there and just wait and see if it does something, right? I'm seeing that right here. I'm going to assume that it's a, it's going to be a, an ultraviolet, right? Ghost orbs. Let's see. Spear box is nothing. Ghost riding is a myling. Freezing would be a gen. Dots would be a gorio. Perfect. Now, no Karen, no update on the Karen yet. I think she actually got smart about it. Uh, this is for the weekly challenge. So basically, if you get the weekly challenge done, you get like 5,000 XP for it. So it's a pretty good, uh, pretty good XP, pretty good. Did it step through this and then not give off... If that's the case, then this is an Obake. So you'd step through this one. Curious. Curious. Let's see what we got here. That's 33 degrees. <laughs> that right there is 33 degrees. It's hard to tell, but it's 33. It's just above the freezing mark. If it's at freezing too, it won't just sit there. Right? That's kind of the tier one way of, of it's just barely sitting above. I mean, if it stepped in that and it didn't give me anything before, I'm curious if it would give me... You know what? I'm going to test out this theory. I'm going to say that it's a... Uh, because that looks like another... It looks like it's another ghost event. I'm going to say that this one is like an Obake. I'm just putting in my glasses and be like... Mm. I'm back. Welcome back, Lord Slash. And it was a Gorio. Okay, I'm totally fine with leaving out when we did if it was a Gorio. Gor Gorios, you would never be able to tell. 
With this mode, you'll never be able to tell a Gorio. Don't feel bad if you get a Gorio because they suck. Because <laughs> Gorio, the only way you can tell a Gorio is with the dots. Right? That's it. And I know you guys can sit there and you can be like, well, but you could get, uh, you know, the ghost could, you know, uh, the, the ghost could tell you, you know, where, where it is or whatever. Uh, or uh, what, what was I going to say? The, you know, the Gorios don't leave their, their room. And that's true, right? But how do you tell the difference between a Gorio and a ghost that just doesn't want to leave the room? Hide and seek? Is it too much to ask for me to get a ghost that's easily identifiable from the hunt? Is that hard? <laughs> it's crazy. I literally just finished watching your beginner's guide on YouTube. What's up, Kim Ye? How are you doing today? Welcome in. This is too much to ask. Could be. All right, we got fingerprints again. Suppressed, thank you so much for the four month resub. I really do appreciate it. The fingerprints, is this the room that it's in? Another fingerprint. We have freezing breath in here? We do have freezing breath in here. All right. So let's assume that you're in here. Hello, they just came from the dentist's appointment. What's happening? Hello there, Majori. Uh, we are currently attempting to do the uh, weekly challenge this week. Primitive. So we really don't have a whole lot. I mean, it could be another miling. It seemed like it was quiet. I'm really going to have to learn to listen for it. We have another EMF4, which is probably an EMF5. I, I mean, like, this game really likes to mess with me on these. For some reason. Right? Miling, it'd be great if we got like a six finger fingerprint or something like that. But with it being so dark, it's, it's, I mean, like, there's no way I'm going to wait around for it to hunt again. Um, so we're just going to see if we get, if we get freezing or if we get ghost riding, right? I'm really hoping we get ghost riding. And that way we'll just be good to go. Freezing Tim's doesn't mean anything except that it helps you to identify where the ghost room is fruity so like if you're walking around and you get freezing breath in a room and you're getting and you don't have freezing breath anywhere else in the house it could be an indicator that it's the that it's the ghost room love your content yo eagle i appreciate that well that's an obake look at that six fingers there we go Ta-da! time to go I wonder if it's leaning everything to either easily identifiable or, like, stuff that you would normally get. Like, you're not going to get, like, dots or orbs. All right. I got to grab. Welcome back. I've got some jobs ready for you. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Three, two. There we go, chat. Oh. Perfect. Perfect. So so perfect. It's okay. That won't be in the video. Oh. Yeah, we got six fingers. No, Mac VG. Thank you for that follow. Welcome to the Beard of Baron Crew. Eagle 2014. Thank you for the heart me. Lillian, thank you for the roses. All right. We're here. All right, we're here. Take a look at the equipment. All right. Thought I followed no months ago. Well, now you followed now. Well, Baron, you got one right. I've gotten two right, Fluffy. Wait, you have hair? I thought you were bald. Oh, I do have hair. Why would I not have hair? Dirty Jojo, thank you for that follow. Welcome to the Bearded Crew. Bearded Baron Crew. 
Hide and seek. Some small child, thank you for the vault. Hey, ghost! Hey! This is faithful, thank you for that follow. Welcome in. You can hide there? Not only can you hide here, you can hide over here. But I like this spot better. I have a whole video on the pro hiding spots on every single map. So, like, every place that I normally hide at, I break down for you guys exactly where it's the best places and where dead zones are. So. Should check it out. It's a good video. It's very informative. Alright, no fingerprints. <clears throat> Alright, didn't move anything. Wish they would add new maps. That'd be cool, would it? That'd be a cool thing. We have, uh, can I see my breath in here? It's the only room that's open. No? What about in here? Nothing's moved around in here. As long as it's not a DU, you're fine. Yeah, but you'll know that it's a DU pretty quickly. I feel like it was upstairs. Maybe it's not. I feel like wherever it was, it would have thrown stuff. But up here, I'm not seeing anything being... It looks like it's been thrown. Maybe I heard things differently. Yep, new challenges have already dropped. Hey, thank you for that follow. Welcome to the Bearded Baron crew. Only the pros can hide from Dio's. I mean, I can hide from a Dio. Right? But you guys would call it cheating. You naysayers. I have no idea where this ghost came from. It threw a cup. I heard the cup. Let's check in here. Nope, that's there. Okay, that cup's there. Okay, it's likely upstairs then? It came from over there. It came from someplace. We're gonna find out where. Alright, not that cup. Hmm. Ah, there's the cup. Told you, chat. You gotta listen. Wow, and we already got ghost riding. I like it. Sweet. Let's go check the van for EMF5. I set that down, and the ghost was like, I got it. Don't worry about it. What's up, Avaris? How are you doing today? Well, I know, boy, when I miss you, I'm booted. Java Ezekiel Disgusman. Thank you for that follow. Welcome in. No EMF 5 yet. Right? No e if we got no EMF 5, and we got no freezing, right? If it was no freezing, even still, this... If it's no EMF 5... Then it's probably a mare. Would be my guess. Or it would be a Maroi. Bring in the salt while we're at it. That's a three. Again, Dio? No, it's not a Dio. If it was a Dio, it would have found us during the last hunt. Dio's you'll know because it'll move very fast until it gets until it gets close to you and then it'll slow down a whole bunt. You're a soul. The giveaway ends when I'm at basic, Sag. Well you don't have to uh you don't have to be present to win. Cha and this goes until we do the giveaway at the end of the subathon. So it's whenever the subathon ends. 
Which for chat, I mean, it could. It's probably going to be in the next thirty-seven hours. Would be my guess. But can we add a challenge to the weekly challenge? What would you add to the weekly challenge? And it's definitely not freezing. Yeah, we definitely don't have freezing yet. So see, if I don't have freezing and I don't have any of my five, then that's either Mare, Diusion, or Thay. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go Mare. <laughs> Goggles all in. You guys hate me, don't you? You just hate me. It's okay. There's more deserving people. Well, that's. A, I mean, that's a, a very humble way of thinking about it. Okay. Let's see if we got it right. Let's see if we got Mare. Now, I'm taking the assumption that we didn't get freezing and I did not see Ema 5 activity. Without any ultraviolet and ghost riding, that's why I'm going with Mare. Nope, and it was a Maroi. So we did have freezing and it was a Maroi, right? And it just was slow because our sanity was high. Where's all your other friends? What do you mean? Lost Trolling, thank you for the follow. Underscore, thank you for the follow. Uh, I'm over on Twitch right now. There's 760 other friends on there. And that's what you mean. Aim change. Thank you so much for the gifted sub. Then explain this. Explain what? What are we explaining? Where are you? Hide and seek. What should I eat? Just eat whatever you want. What's up, Paranormal MIT? Just happened that I see his videos is that he has... Just happens when I see his videos, he has the same people? What do you mean I have the same people? You mean the same, like, in chat, people? Is that what you mean? Check here. It's a very fast hunt. See nothing here. Oh, know that I game with? It's because I don't game with people. <laughs> Double touch? Is that a Yuri? I'm gonna go Yuri. I got a double touch. Sound like a double touch, anyways. And it shut the door all the way. Jilly, thank you for that brand new sub. Let's go TikTok. Right? We got EMF5, probably no ultraviolet. Which does rule out. It does rule out a Yuri. It did move slow. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to make a pizza. It's only 3 a.m. Only 3 a.m.? I'm going to subscribe when I have enough to. Toxic Waste, I appreciate that. There's no rush. I appreciate the love and the support that you guys show me. I really do. Twins curve? Maybe. Tachanya. Thank you for that follow. Welcome to the Beauty Parent Club. Okay, she blew out the light. She did a ghost event. <sighs> Nothing there. Okay. Definitely no ultraviolet. See, she, we had another double door touch right there. That's that's like textbook. That's that's like a Yuri, man. Right? Maybe it's not an EMF-5, but even still, without an ultraviolet, then an ultraviolet would be a Yuri. The reason why I keep saying that is, is because I can hear, like, it touching two doors at one time, and it's shutting the door. Right? So maybe that EMF-4 actually was just an EMF-4? Because we've got a lot of touches here. A bunch of stuff. Let's see, what else would a Yuri need? Orbs, freezing temps, and dots. 
So the only thing we get would be freezing and the lack of other evidence would be my guess. All right, I'm going to bring this in, bring this in. Twins touching the doors at the same time. Now, it didn't sound like a twin interaction, though. Right? It was literally, it was like at the same time. It's like double touch on the door. It's not my birthday, Fluffy. All right? Not my birthday. Let's shut the door again. I don't care. I got scared. Oh my gosh, I can't see anything. I have twins can confirm that they touch doors. I don't think it's those twins. It's a breath event? It's where he breathes on you. Alright. I'm gonna go with my gut here. I'm gonna say Yuri. I mean, we would need freezing for it to be a Yuri. I need to stop just guessing at it, and we need to just look at the the evidence, right, while we can, or while, while we have it. Right, he seems to be back over this way, so I'm going to put it back over here. Cha-cha-cha-cha! It's like 40 degrees. It's not a Wraith, right? It's not a Revenant. It's not a Diogen, not a Thay. Still would be really cool if I could get a ghost that was easily identifiable from the hunt. That would be so cool. That would be so awesome. I was alone for it, and I missed you. We prevented the hunt with the crucifix, right? I'm assuming that we don't have any EMF-5 at this point in time, right? I'm going to go with Yuri. I'm going to go with my gut. With those double, double, it, it like, it's hard to explain, but once you realize, and I'm probably going to be wrong here. Let me see if I'm actually right first, and then I'll explain why that I came to that conclusion. And it was Yuri. All right, perfect. Like prepared some jobs for you. What's the week's weekly challenge? It's where we dominate. Pow. There we go. An easy $5,250. $5,250. So the reason why I thought that it was a Yuri was because twice it did a thing to where it shut the door, right? Yuri's love to shut doors. So I was opening up the door, and I was hearing it almost sounds like uh, it almost sounds like two doors being shut at the exact same time. But it was only happening to, like, one door. It's a very unique sound that happens with the Yuris, but that's what led me to believe that it was a Yuri. Send me joke? What? You didn't get the bone? I did not get the bone. Can confirm, did not get the bone. But I did get this. If you made it this far into the video and you like this kind of stuff, please be sure to follow, subscribe, comment, all that kind of stuff. But at the end of the day, you are loved. You are valued. I appreciate you guys being here, and I'll see you guys next time. Yeah, let's go chat.